Hey, it's Chad Jackson here at Cedarville University. Wanted to show you our typical setup for a two camera shoot in a classroom. Here's our room that we're gonna be shooting in today. Uh, we've got two cameras, one set up in the back. It's gonna be a tight shot. And then we have a second camera over here set up to be able to show our speaker and get close-ups of the audience when they speak. For audio, we have our speaker mic'd up with a lapel. And then we have two handheld um, mics over here super cardio mic microphones that are shooting out into the audience to pick up what uh, questions we may have come in. So let me take you out here. You'll notice the SDI cables running down along the floor. And right here is our, our setup. All of our equipment is built into this rolling rack. So many things going on here. Down here you'll see the microphone receivers and also a couple delay boxes because of the signal coming from our cameras a little bit behind the audio that we're getting headphones for monitoring we have a we have a laptop in here that is um let's get it's caught there we go we've got a laptop here running powerpoint and also all of our settings for the atem and uh, a couple other things and then up here is all of our controls so here's our main um hd uh, ATEM switcher, Blackmagic switcher, that is doing all of our switching. Uh, over here we have a Blackmagic HyperDeck, which is what we're recording with. And then up here we have a soundboard that is controlling our LAV and our two uh, stage handhelds. We also have a couple other microphones that can be hooked up um, if we need to. I'll show you that in just a minute. And then um, back here you can see the antennas that are used for receiving the mic signals coming out and then um, just a couple other things down here at the bottom um, we've got a place to plug in usb so like our our powerpoint slides go in there and then we've got drawers to store like batteries and adapters our microphones all go in here and then our two cameras actually ride down here in this bottom uh, larger drawer and then this right here is the aja helo that we use for streaming um, we have a network um, uh, system in here. We have a router that actually um, takes all of our uh, Blackmagic equipment and makes it all talk well together. All we have to do is plug into an ethernet port that's on the side of this. And as long as we have an internet connection, we're good to go. Um, so up here, we've got your typical switching, you know, for all of our preview monitors. I can even do um, picture in picture uh, with our speaker. So you can see here we got picture in picture up in the corner. Um, you'll see here this is um, a stream deck that uh, I just have running various macros and a couple additional buttons that aren't on this smaller rack mounted ATEM switcher. A um, couple other things as we walk around here we've got our power and SDI cables on spools. Uh, so those just ride on that side when we're when we're traveling they sit like this and when we're here they sit like that. On the back, um, we've got battery chargers here for the cameras. Also our headset systems, our EarTech headsets. Uh, these have everything plugged into them. So we've got two uh, power units. And then these are all patch panels. This is our patch panels for HDMI, SDI, TRS quarter inch for all the sound. And then we have a, um, a network uh, hub there for all of our internet coming in. And then also I have a drawer full of patch cables. If you're not familiar with patch uh, panels, basically all the ports on all the equipment that's in the rack are not connected directly to each other. They all go to the patch panel first, and then we use a small patch cable to connect them there so that any setup that we have, many of them are much more complicated than this, we can easily unplug and plug things in without reaching inside the cabinet and moving cables around. Makes this unit much, much more flexible. It's very mobile for small setups, but it's very expandable. There's a couple tables uh, from the front and back panels. I don't have them here, but they, they latch onto the sides and uh, extend out so that we can have other laptops. We'll even bring in our bigger uh, switcher so that we have more buttons available to us and we just 
change the where the cables are patched and we just hook it up to the new switcher and we're good to go. You can have, also have other people maybe running sound off of a bigger soundboard, um, somebody watching social media, keeping an eye on our feed. This gets much larger. But the cool thing about this small unit is we can roll up and have um, cameras set up and be ready to record a class in about 10 minutes. Uh, it also tears down in about five minutes and we roll it back to the office. So very efficient. Uh, very useful setup here. Hope you liked it.